Baltimore County Police are still trying to figure out what caused a crash to close a school. One person was injured in that crash that happened yesterday. Roosevelt Leverage live this morning in Edgemere, outside Sparrows Point High School, with the newest information. Rosie. Well, no school today for students at the high school and the middle school. I mean, take a look behind me here. You can see the big tarp covering up the big hole that's right in the cafeteria. Now, this, ha this is what it looked like overnight, give you an idea of the car actually in the building. It happened at around 9.30 last night here at, right at the cafeteria here at Sparrows Point High School. County police say the car went right into the building. Police at this point say only the driver was inside at the time and they had to be rescued by the fire department. The driver was taken to shock trauma and right now we don't know who, what their condition is right now. Police are looking at the possibility that another car was involved in this, but they're still trying to figure things out. Well, let's come back out here live and you can see right there the big hole. They're going to have a lot of work to cut out for them to try to repair the school. So that's why, once again, both the high school and the middle school here are closed here at Sparrows Point High School. Once again, the high school and the middle school are closed for students here at Sparrows Point. We'll have more on this coming up a bit later. Roosevelt Leftwich, ABC2 News.